Presentation Training Series, Port Input Setup. Presentation can monitor activity on certain port devices and generate event information from that activity. These events may be interpreted in different ways during an experiment. Most port-related settings are contained on the Port panel of the Settings tab. Click on Port Properties to display the Port Settings window. The Port Devices box displays detected devices connected to the system. All port input setups start with adding one or more port input channels. A port input channel generates events described by a time, numerical code value, and a type. The port input channel settings will depend on what type of port the channel is using and how that port is used by your device. See the presentation documentation for details of all settings. Let's assume we have a response device and an fMRI scanner trigger connected to an interface box that sends event information over a serial port or an emulated serial port over USB. Anytime a serial port is used, you must select the serial port configuration in the Port Devices box. The appropriate parameters will depend on the device that you are connecting. Assume bytes of values 1, 2, 3, 4 are sent for response buttons and 9 for the fMRI trigger. The Port Input Channel test window will display the numerical codes for events generated by the channel. Port Input Channel events are not directly accessible. They are only used in combination with other features. If the scenario uses fMRI mode to synchronize with the scanner, set fMRI mode to use the channel we created. The value contents is the numerical code for the port input channel events that should be interpreted as the fMRI trigger. Port input channel events may be of type start or end. For serial port channels of this configuration, all events will be start events. The fMRI mode test window will display event information for triggers. In this setup, only port input channel events with code value 9 will be used as fMRI mode trigger events. To interpret the other channel events as response buttons, we add a port response device. Configure the port response device to use the new input channel. The Buttons box will contain the possible numerical values for the port input channel configuration used. We can use the Response Button test window to test that those values from the port input channel correctly generate responses. Another feature that uses port input channels is the Input Port feature. An input port can record all start events from any port input channel in the scenario log file and provide access to that in event information during a scenario. This is used in cases where an external system is sending general information using a port which needs to either be logged or interpreted during a scenario in an application-specific way. However, note that when interpreting port input channel events as fMRI mode triggers or responses, you will not also add an input port, as that would generate duplicate event information. In our example, we would not use an input port. See the presentation documentation for details about supported port devices and port input channel settings. 